Okay, now that we've put on some content onto the Falcon Pie Player using the file manager, we can use the playlist tab now to create a playlist. You see I have one playlist on there already called playlist2.list. If I click that, I'll see the details of the playlist. Here over the right, bottom right, you see the actual contents. Um, what I want to do is I want to add a new playlist, so I click in here, new playlist, and I give it a new playlist name, which I'll just call playlist3. I click add. And notice that it adds it to the list. So now when I click on playlist 3, I'll see the details of playlist 3, which there is none. So let's go ahead and add some entries into the playlist. To do that, you select the type of entry that you want. There are four types. There's a music and sequence data, music only, sequence data only, and a pause. And a pause is where you could select uh, the number of seconds you want to pause between songs. So I'll select music and sequence data. And if you notice, the music and the sequence combination boxes have been populated with the content that you uploaded using the file manager. So the first one is Carol of the Bells MP3 and the corresponding Carol of the Bells sequence file. I click Add, and that adds it. And I'll go through there and just create some entries. You see I've put in four entries and I'll go ahead and throw a pause in there also of five seconds. And now that they're in there you can click the save button and that will save them. And now Playlist 3 has those entries. And now you can rearrange them by selecting, clicking and dragging any of the entries. So I'll drag them a little bit and then click save. And now they'll keep that well, actually looks like there might be a little bug there and it needs to be cleaned up click save and now they're saved if you want to edit any particular playlist that you've already have created you can just click the link and it will go ahead and bring up that particular playlist and then you can drag them, move them, delete them. To remove, you click on one and you hit remove. And click save again. And that's how you create playlists. If you want to rename a playlist, all you need to do is click on it. And then there where the name is at, you just give it the new name. Like if I want to name it 4 instead of 3. And then click save. And that will actually rename it. And that's pretty much all there is to creating playlists. And now that the playlists are created, we can go ahead and uh, schedule those playlists, which the next video will discuss.